All right, we got some old rusty tools. Wrought iron, handmade, some not handmade. Some have maker's marks, some don't. Some are just random fittings. I always pick up things like this. I'm out in the wild, <clears throat> random fittings, because they're useful. When you're building something in the yard, you know, you need that piece. You don't have time to go looking for it. So if you have a pile of this in the garage, you're all set. And it's just fun to have around. These are World War I French uh, barbed wire cut, I believe. I haven't had time to... Re there is writing on these, but I just got these from France as, as well. I got I to gotta clean these and look at those. This is, a, I think, a, a buggy or like a Model T bolt wrench these are these are definitely wrought iron i love these you can always tell by the tips you can just see the craftsmanship i love these these are earlier you can tell they're rough and crude these are great this weighs a ton i'm not sure some old timer said it was some kind of the end of a tool i could see that it would, it would the, something would fit into this and it would be used for, for something. I don't know. If you know, let me know. This is great. I love this. I got this in, in a middle field, which is an Amish area. This has a maker's stamp. I did research on this a few years back and I kind of forget what I learned. But I identified the maker. I think he was in, from Pennsylvania. This is beautiful. There was a few Amish guys checking this. This is for wood. There's a few Am Amish guys checking this out too at the antique store when I got this. The handles wood. I, I just cover it with cardboard to keep it in better condition because it's kind of splitting. The patina is awesome. This is like a battle axe. I love this thing. What else we got? You say weed on them. Patented July. I think 25th, 1913, that's handy. I love the old patent dates. This, I don't know, if you know, let me know. Some kind of trap or something. This is for, from an anchor. This is handy. It tells you how, how much weight it can hold, the size. This still screws out. This could be really handy. I got a bunch of chains. This is either a handle, I believe, to something. I learned what these are. I see these around, and now I'm just gonna start buying them and start collecting them and probably reselling a few. These are antique um, crate openers. That would be so handy if your job's opening crates, right? Old timey wood and metal crates pried open. You got a little hammer. This one's a little more rough. But yeah, I see these around. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start collecting these. This is this is definitely wrought iron. Blacksmith tools. I see a lot of blacksmith tools, and I went through a blacksmith phase where I want I went out and I bought a lot of things like this. They're around somewhere. But yeah, these are always fun. I'm sure you guys and gals see these out when you're out in the wild. They're fun to research, and sometimes when you build things, it's just good to have these things around. 